Today we're going to test overclocking on a STM32 microcontroller. We've got two boards here, both equipped with the same microcontroller and running identical code. The board at the back runs at the standard 72 MHz speed, while the one in the front has been overclocked to 128 MHz, which is a 78% increase. As the clock speed ramps up, so does the temperature. But just how hot can it get? Today, we'll uncover the answer. The microcontroller surface temperatures were checked before powering up the two boards. Board 1 is 18.4 degrees Celsius and board 2 is 18.5 degrees Celsius. The microcontroller clock waveforms on the oscilloscope appear normal, with one operating at 72 MHz and the other at 128 MHz. The running time is tracked by the clock timer. Now, we'll let them run for a bit and see how the temperatures change. After 3 minutes, board 2 is already at 22.7 degrees Celsius, while board 1 is at 20.0. After 11 minutes, board 2 is at 24.5 degrees Celsius and board 1 is at 20.5 degrees Celsius. After 32 minutes, board 2 is still at 24.5 degrees Celsius, but board 1 has climbed to 21.8. After 14 hours, board 1 is at 22.3 degrees Celsius, board 2 at 26.2. That's where we stop. The overclocking did raise the temperature a bit, but nothing too serious. Looks like it can handle the extra speed without getting too hot. If you like this video, please consider giving it a thumbs up and subscribing for more content like this. Thank you for watching.